In Penang, Malaysia, a 71-year-old woman, Mrs. Neo, and her son live by themselves after her husband, who was the support of the family, passed away due to a fall two or three years ago. Life has been difficult for this mother-son pair as they both suffer from intellectual disabilities and are unable to manage household chores properly. Worried about their living environment after some recent flooding, Suji volunteers mobilized to help clean up their home along with some relatives. When Mr. Ngo was still alive, he did all the household chores. He was very healthy and strong, but he suddenly passed away after a fall two or three years ago. After Mr. Nyong passed away, everything has changed. Life has also become more difficult for this family. Because both Mrs. Nyong and her son suffer from intellectual disability, they are unable to deal with household chores properly. The rain flooded my house and made it wet all over. Worried about the living environments of the mother-son pair after a flash flood hit several areas in Penang, city volunteers mobilized to help clean up their house and let the son, Bun Leong, to clear out the items they were not used anymore. Their relatives also joined in to help out. We may visit them once every week or two weeks. If they need anything for help, for example, like going to the hospital, I will drive them there. If we as relatives don't help him in this way, then who will help him? We cannot be a bystander to this family. We should try our best to help them. You volunteers came to help with love and compassion. Everyone works with one heart to clean up the house from day to night, restoring a more comfortable living environment for this family.